it's a big green gassy slimy running thing big glowy thing with distortion around it i want it ladies and gentlemen girls and boys gamers zombie slayers survivals and all the other wonderful people out there welcome back it's crane bram we're back with another other early access gameplay video this time we're in satisfactory the first person factory building survival-ish game it's currently being produced by the folks over at Coffee Stain Studios and is in open beta from March 8th through the 15th. As always, we're gaming and recording at 4K 60fps, and you can find that benchmark widget right over there, there, on the side of the screen. So, keys were given out for free for this alpha if you signed up. I think I had been signed up for months. And if you pre-ordered the game, then regular alpha for paid owners will be on the 19th. Um, they've said that three tiers are of expansion are unlocked here. There will be six in the alpha, and then, of course, they will continue adding to it. Um, naturally, I've pre-ordered the game. We'll be, uh, streaming this and, uh, recording videos on this, uh, for one of our nights for the, for the foreseeable future. This is a great game. As always, this is being broadcast from the headquarters of the Craincraft Game Server Network. It's a community of survival game enthusiasts. Minecraft, Seven Days to Die, Factorio, Ark, Conan Exiles. The list goes on, folks, that play on a wide variety of survival servers that we run on our network of dedicated servers. If you'd like to play these type of games or just want to come hang out and talk in Discord, check the information below for more information right down there. So, I was standing here in my veritable oasis of factorial delights, pondering life, wondering what the square root of the speed of light was, and I thought, hey, gee, those are some pretty looking mountains over there. Way over there. Wait, how big is this place? Huh. Mission time, road trip. So, I, I don't really know. I, that's a question that I have not, I don't know the answer to. I don't know if this is a procedural world. I don't know if these are hard generated maps. Um, I don't know if there's a border. I don't know if it's some combination of the above. Um, why don't we go find out? Um, see that big mountain over there? That's where we're going. Road trip! Okay, so there are a few things before we do that I before we leave that I want to do so I'm gonna store everything uh, I'm gonna take some uh, some concrete I guess uh, we'll make a little bit before we leave I don't have any food yes I do I have some I have some nuts that I eat I, I'm, I'm gonna have me some nuts when I get hungry so all right so let's go. We have a food in case we get into any trouble and need to heal ourselves. We have our poker. Ooh, ooh, get away. And uh, we have our very bouncy spacesuit. And we are off exploring the world. Oh, I'm so excited. What is this? It's a big, green, gassy, slimy, running thing huh oh that does damage to me ow okay so i can see that being a resource later on collecting poison gas and processing it you know not like specifically poison but poisonous poisonous where'd that come from so um yeah so are we what do you think uh put down in the comments when I was going through this section, did you think that the world was going to go on forever? Or do you think that that fog right there is actually the end of the world? Well, we're going to find out. So, these do look like they're my... What in God's name is... Are both of those? Um... Big glowy thing with distortion around it. I want it. What 
is that? Hmm. Ah, uh, well, whatever it is, it saw me. Come on! Oh, what the? Ooh! Ooh, shoot stuff! Come here, punk! What are you doing with the range stuff, man? Yeah, okay. Oh! No, 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 no. No, you will pay for that. Oh, ow. Yes, you will pay. You shall pay! Wait, where'd he go? Come on now. What did you say? Can you. Alien organs. Okay, I guess. I mean, we found we found alien carpuses. I guess we can find uh, some uh, some of that. I strongly advise you to harvest this specimen. Uh, Ada, is that you? You don't sound normal. Why do you sound like a greedy, messed up AI all of a sudden? Harvest. Um, that's not subliminal woman. A Mercer Sphere work in progress. Huh. Are you gonna tell me to get it again? I really do want this thing though, it's pretty. Your contract legally compels you to harvest this artifact. Okay, that's creepy. But still, I want it. Okay, that's even creepier. There's no more noise. Something gonna happen? Nope. Okay, so what is it? A weird alien thing with an impossibly smooth surface. Work in progress. Analyzing this will not give you anything. But if it's incredibly smooth, I can rub it. <laughs> Who knows what that might get me. Maybe an alien genie. Like, I rub you, come out alien genie and give me my wishes. And probably eat me. But anyway, my luck. I'd be like, ooh, look up. <coughs> ah! and yeah, that'd be the end of me. So are we still, yeah, we're still headed towards the big mountain. It kind of looks all the same so far. So... But, I mean, we definitely haven't... The place is definitely huge. I, uh... That base camp I had built very near the starting location. Okay, that's definitely edge of the world type stuff right there. So... Oh, look at that over there. Like... Alien hot air balloon thingies floating in the sky. Alien inverted lollipops. Um, yeah, science techie things. You know. <laughs> okay. Ooh, what is that? Hello, Mr. Bird. Are you going to eat me? Hey there, Mr. Bird. How you doing? Can't interact with you? No? Hmm. Well, what happens if I poke you? Yeah, I'd probably run away too if I was an asshole. Too, if somebody was an asshole to me like that. Okay. So there was a creature over there. Looked like uh, pretty much standard stuff. But we are heading towards these uh, these weird balloon-looking thingies over here. Da 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 Hello, uh, alien fairy thingy. As long as you don't bite my head off, I'll be okay. Okay, so this is starting to look a little bit different. Well, these are new trees. Oh, that looks... So, maybe the place does have biomes. Oh, this is definitely a different biome type area right in here. Oh, this is pretty cool looking. I like it. I like it. One thing that I will really have to say, um, and I've noted this in my Let's Play series, this is a great looking and a great playing title for early access. I am all with the hype on this one. If they follow through with the same vein of what they have in early access, 
this will probably be one of the best factory simulation games around. If they open this thing up to modders with a sufficiently powerful modding API, this thing will blow up. I mean, just plain and simple. I mean, look look at how people have risen up around, uh, you know, oh, 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 oh. Yeah, that was damage. So we have to go around the edge of this field. Anyway, look how people have risen up around things like um, uh, green, green, which means I can take damage. Uh, in games like uh, Fallout 4, Factorio, things like that. Um, so yeah, if you're listening, guys, modding API, make it powerful, build it in from ground floor. It'll get big. So, wait, wait, I heard something. Okay, he's too far away to have seen me. Hmm. Okay, so we're going to keep going. Oh, yeah. So this is definitely far different than the starting area. So it definitely looks like there are biomes out here. And it definitely looks like we can keep going. We can go right through there, it looks like. Why do I keep hearing... I keep feeling like something's following me. I keep, like, hearing footsteps and stuff. Well, well the problem is going to be getting down without dying. Oh, shit. Where's it at? Uh, come on, man. Oh, you want some too, huh? Where are you at? Come on. And I know you're going to go like go over there and tell your buddy, Hey man, I got this dude over here. Want to fight. <sighs> Come on, let's get it over with. Come on, buddy. Oh, you're a little bit tougher than the rest of them. Why did I? Oh, yeah. Goodbye, dude. Yeah, he was like a boss or something, or at least... Uh, more shiny, weird, gloopy things. Give me that. So, I wonder if he was like a more powerful monster that was guarding that uh, Mercer Sphere. I mean, he definitely took, what? Uh, four or five hits, at least. Uh, before I pushed him off the edge and he was still alive. So, eat me some nuts. Eat me some nuts. Love them when they're salted. Yeah. Alright, so. Still too high. Maybe since this goes up, we can just thread our way through here. Yeah, this looks like this might be an option. Maybe around this side? Uh, yeah, that's good enough. Alright, guys. So there's definitely some of these uh, some new trees that I haven't seen before. Uh, let's just... Uh, yeah, let's go this way. Just to stay out of their hair so I don't have to fight anymore. This is a exploration mission. Of course, as soon as I say that, where are you at? Come on, dude. Wait, where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? <gasps> Look. Oh, this is definitely a new biome. So that answers the question, guys. There are other biomes. Man, the game took a FPS hit coming in here, but it seems to... And I see it dropping down into the 40s occasionally. Oh, uh, no, come on. Oh, what the heck was all that? Come on, me and you. We'll just stand here and duke it out, me and you. Yeah. What is that? Other than... 
Wait, wait, wait. Where's that? Where's he at? That sounded like the attack growl, but I don't see him. Oh, there he is. There he is. Okay. So what is that right there? That's that. Oh, it's a flower of some type. Can't seem to harvest it. Oh, 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 it's opening. Oh, I thought it was opening. <laughs> Doesn't look like... Okay, now it's... Hard to tell what it's doing. I thought like when it opened up. Hmm. Hit speed. Well, there it goes. Hmm. That means I got a time going through there. Or I can just run through and take the damage. Screw it. I'll just run through and take the damage. How about that? <gasps> oh my god, it walks. Is it after me? No, but this is. Come on, you. Get out of here. Okay, so was it alive, or did it just stand up when I came close to it? Oh, does it... Oh. Maybe they stay out on the ground. When you get closer to them, they stand up, go into a defensive posture. You keep getting closer, they spray the stuff. Maybe. It's just a guess. All right. Definitely a new biome. Pretty leaves. Oh, wow. You know what this reminds me of, in a way? I want to say, like, this is what No Man's Sky should have looked like when it came out and played like. And this is an alpha. And this is the way No Man's Sky should have looked and played when it came out as a release. <laughs> I'm not talking content-wise. I'm talking about, like, performance and looks. This is amazing. I, I'm, I'm blown away, guys. So... We are definitely going to try to find a new biome. Ah, look, water. I know that may not sound like a big deal, but this is the, actually the first time that we've seen water. Uh, we can swim. Uh, I don't think it's deep enough for me to dive, but it's not letting me, like, crouch or anything. Okay. How about if I get in here and do my little thing? Do I just electrocute myself? <laughs> Dear, what happens if I stick my finger in the socket? <laughs> Anyway. Oh, look, fruit. <gasps> not fruit, not fruit. Oh, where are these? Do die. Get away, get away, get away, get, get away. Oh, wow. I actually do that much health damage? Or would I have I already have some existing damage? I thought I. Thought I ate some nuts a little bit back and got feeling a bit better. There we go. All right, so we have full health if we get attacked again. What is that? Buttheads. Oh, I thought he like. I thought they go away. Go away. I had thought they like flew off. Now I heard it. Where'd it go? I'm gonna let one of these, like, fly up and attack me. I've got full health. Oh, wow. Uh. Hmm. Well, it only did one health, but it, like, blew me apart. It looks like they leave the plant that they come out of leaves a carpus behind. What is this? A green power slug. Give me that. A strange slug radiating a weak, strange power. Wee-oo! Welcome to the Twilight Zone. Man, nice looking stuff, man. Great graphics, great graphics. And the game runs beautiful on 4K. Um, just to show you my settings. Uh, let's see here. I am... Um, Running full 4K, uh, high texture, medium shadow, high post-processing, medium anti-aliasing, high VFX, high foliage, uh, far view distance. Um, so, 
I had to come down off of Ultra to get a solid 60, even with my 2800. But, again, early access, 4K, looking like this, still able to hit 60 FPS on high settings. Good job, guys. Good job. Except for those occasional drops. Come on. Come on, Punkolas. Come on. Come on. Ooh! Now, huh. It looks like one of them did some damage to me even though I blocked him. I didn't get, like, thrown back like I did the other times. But I was pretty sure I healed up again. Anyway. I have one point of damage if it happens again. So. And it looks like we're going to get a chance to prove that right here. I'm going to keep following this river for a while. We're going to see just how far it takes us. A bacon agaric. Any planet that has bacon is okay in my book. Especially as a renewable plant. I can plant bacon? Oh yeah, baby. Give me that. So the pale berries seem to be better at restoring health than the, uh, what are these? Than the barrel nuts. Uh, so I try to pick those up when I see them. Oh, really nice. Mushroom forest. Can I harvest these? No, there's nothing there. How about these guys? Can I harvest these? No. How about the mushroom? Yeah, that's not going to be a harvest. They're like made out of rock on the bottom. <laughs> I feel like I've been heading through this biome these forever. These are pretty big biomes. Do, do, do. On the road again. Just can't wait to get on the road again. Oh, the life I love is making music with my friends. Well, I can't wait to get on the road again. What is this over here? Whoa, what was that? I heard something. Oh. Hello. Oh, lag. What was that? Wow. That was like serious, serious lag right there. <laughs> yeah, that just about cost me. Wait, what is this? Is that like some wreckage? Ooh, right in the middle of poison. Okay, that that's, that's yeah, I just gotta go check it out. Sorry. Eat open drop pie. Oh, oh, what is that? What am I being attacked by? I should have known better. Oh. Some of those stupid fly things. Okay, so we're going to find out if the berries are actually better. Eat one. One health. Let's get our barrel nuts. Half the health. Okay, so the, the berries are better at restoration. How about this? Can we eat to restore two health segments? Oh, nice. That's even better. So we'll just, we'll just deal with the... the, the berries for right now and then we'll put our xeno zapper back in our hands because we might have some baddies to zap and let's go find out what's up with this drop pot again our emergency door status repairs needed battery broken needs 30 megawatts okay well the thing is i really can't oh 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 no Arrgh! Look, man, all this, like, sneaking behind me, mm, mm. uncool, dude. So, there's a nice little uh, piece to the world. Findable, findable loot boxes. Or, you know, findable tech, however you want to say it. You know, I know loot boxes has a bad connotation. So... All right, so we were headed this way in general, so I guess we'll keep heading this way. Uh, there's a big... Oh, let's just run through this. Uh, I may have made a really bad decision. This all 
looks toxic around here. Uh-oh, 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 no, 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 no well, anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, I'm sorry it ended so soon, but it answers a question. I did not find the edge of the world, but I did find a couple of different biomes, new resources, some, like, weird work-in-progress spheres, a growing green slug, just all kinds of stuff, guys. So, I really think there's so much potential for the game. There's so much neat stuff left to find out. Um, that right there, I can't wait to build a base on that flying monstrosity over there and make him my friend. So, anyway, you know how this works, guys. If you liked what you saw, like what you heard, press that big red button. I get a little bit of validation from some random person on the internet. You get daily doses of Crane Sanity. Me. Uh, also, remember to check out the CraneCraft Game Server Network. Uh, come talk on our Discord. Come meet me. Um, and we will see you on the next video. Uh, another early access game, or maybe Rim World, or Seven Days to Die. Doesn't matter. I'll be back. You guys have a good one. Peace out.